The aim of the N sensor is to achieve an economic optimum rate of nitrogen in each part of the field and to avoid losses into the environment. Yeah, the N sensor system is remarkably easy to use. Once you have uh, calibrated the machine, it will then vary the application rate in line with the spectrometer readings it receives as you drive over the field. Mounted on the tractor cab, out of the way of operations, but in an excellent position for gaining a clear view of the crop, the N sensor software system operates on the move, measuring light reflectance from the crop. Although large variations in crop color can be seen by the human eye, less obvious effects of nutrient deficiency are difficult to detect. The end sensor, however, is able to sense and register variations across the entire spectrum and therefore picks up differences that we are unable to detect. So as we drive over what appears to be very uniform crops, uh, we've been amazed to see that the, uh, the nitrogen requirement, as dictated by the end sensor, has uh, varied in some cases 20-30% uh, either way. It's clear that it's cutting back where there is available nitrogen, but yet increasing the dose where that nitrogen is, is a lot more scarce.